FK Veganuary. I am currently towing at home. It's a ridiculous thing to have. What a night. <laughs> Veganuary. Maggie was in the pickup and decided to lock the doors. Aye, so that was quite a bit of drama. This tire's actually all right. Dad actually stole the valve out it, so. So it's uh, currently night time, uh, just after six. Still afternoon, really, but aye, it's Scotland pitch black, so. This isn't the most ideal time to film, but this is when things have happened. So, the wee dudes, Dad had taken off the feed wagon to help the neighbour jet his water supply, and uh, it broke down. So, I'm currently towing at home, and the 7030 at the moment, not sure why, has decided to fry its light box. Um, so, it has stopped working, so the only lights I've got are the ones in the front, uh, the headlights, so not really ideal. The wee doubts hasn't really given out any light because the battery's flat because he kept trying to start it. He thinks the lift pump's the baller, so um, he's currently, well, going to try and change it for the old one if we can find it in the garage, get it going kind of need it to feed the cows, you see. If not, we're going to have to block the tyres on the one that we fixed that shafted it shafted at the start of the year and uh, get it going on the feed wagon. Um, aye, this has not been ideal at all. For a lot of hassle. We changed the lift pump for an old lift pump and uh, nothing seems to be working. So we're thinking the thing that makes the lift pumps work just stopped working. So now we've got the old boots that was had the shaft had the shafted shaft and I'm blowing the tires up on it. So we can use that for the feed wagon tomorrow. This tire's actually alright. Dad actually stole the valve out it, so it's the other tire that's got the slow leak. I don't know why he stole the valve at this one for the 7030, but aye, here we are. Um, we got a new one, and uh, it's now in this, and I'm blowing this tyre up. And then the other side, and then take it round, blow it up properly, fill it up with diesel, get it on the feed wagon. And uh, she should be brought for the morning. <laughs> what a night <laughs> hey, So that was quite a bit of drama The other night there With that video that was just up Today I'm back out spreading some slurry Since we've got the weather for it To try and get some out again So Of course using the chick nav Got wee Walter here keeping me company It's uh, Deciding whether or not to choose bone Alright so, just angling my way up and down the hill here. Trying to get as much done as possible. Right, uh, basically, so what happened the other night with the tractor, so Dad thought it was a lift pump, probably was a lift pump. Uh, it stopped working with him when he was leaving uh, from jetting the water supply with a jetter on the back of that tractor, the dudes. And uh, it just stopped on the way out the forest, so I went away up with a pickup, with a chain to give it to the neighbour, and he pulled Dad out the woods with, a, with that, reversed all the way out. And uh, it was getting dark at that point, so I had to reverse all the way out the wood with my head out the side of the pickup because it's got a canopy in the back, so I couldn't see anything, you know. Couldn't see in out the mirror, so I had to open the door. But before that, Maggie was in the pickup and decided to lock the doors. So that was ideal. But the one good thing she did do was she opened the window at the same time. So it was uh, very lucky. But because it was dark, I noticed the door being locked first. And then Maggie knows me out the window. I was like, well, that was lucky. So oh, we just had added to it all at the end of that. So. Oh, little shit, so she is. Um, aye, so I ended up going home to get a bigger tractor 
to tow it right along the road as you've seen with the 7030 and uh, towed it right home uh, and then dad tried putting an old lift pump on and it didn't work either and so started sorting that other tractor up uh, the old doots that had shafted its shaft got it ready, blowed up the tyres, put diesel in it yammering ready to go and then somehow dad managed to get the other tractor going <laughs> there was no diesel getting to the filter but there was diesel coming out the pipe going to the tank uh, from the diesel tank so what he did was he got the airline and blew it into the diesel tank to get enough fuel to go well just to force the fuel out the diesel tank into the lift pump to siphon it and now there's fuel in it it's running again but uh, he's ordering a new one so that well one day it might just stop again and it'll be on the feed wagon and that'll not be ideal because you need to feed the cows you know so that'll be another job soon when the new lift pump comes for changing it over but then at least we know it'll be reliable so it's working as long as there's fuel in it so I don't, we don't understand how it just stopped though that's the other thing but aye that's what's happened but so I wasted all my time getting that other tractor ready blowing up the tyres and that and the other tractor went anyway so just one of the things, never mind. But you know, that's, uh, that's what's been happening. But if you haven't already seen, I have made a discount code up for the whole of January uh, for all merch that you see in my videos. The hoodies, the jackets, the... There's a spider on my phone. Uh, the hoodies, the jackets, and hats, blah, t-shirts, whatever else. Uh, 10% off for the whole of January and the code is FK Veganuary. I'm sure many of you will know the secret meaning behind that but that's the code. It's a ridiculous thing to have Veganuary but to be honest with you it must be dying a death because I have not heard or seen, I don't really watch much telly but I've not seen many adverts about it, to be honest with you. Um, so, it must be, it must have failed, you know. So, all this rubbish about everybody going uh, vegan and it, on the rise and that, it seems to have died a death, you know. it's I've not heard or seen anything, anytime I'm in the shops, that that plant-based aisles getting smaller and smaller and the reduced section is all plant-based food so are folk waking up again? You can only hope but aye still going to get shoved down our throats by the very loud moany complainy yappy wee buggers that cause all these protests and whatnot. but aye Farming, farming's need to stand up and get our own voice and if it's not going to be mainstream media it needs to be social media which is what I'm trying to do myself to be honest that's why I started started out on TikTok started out trying to shout up our opinions on it all but um, just fighting the misinformation because mainstream media is not going to do it any time I watch mainstream media it's slating farming so aye here we are, so that's why I do what I do, but I like actually, I, I don't like all the arguing and that gets a bit endless. What I prefer doing is just uh, recording what I'm doing on the farm and showing it to you good people. <laughs> anyway, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. I'm uh, just going to be slowly cruising up and down the fields today and hopefully soon I'll be doing something a bit more exciting than this. <laughs> Cheers guys!